Love looking at Sheep and Water gracefully slowing off of Flip. That or they're too lazy to pick another damn stage. But you know. What's up, Ken? Brazil stage or bust. Brazil stage or bust. It's Everyone is just playing on the damn waterfall. No, it's always no. You should always pick Brazil. What's it? Uh, I don't even remember the name of it. I don't remember the name of it either. I, don't know. I just lost Amika. Bustling side I don't, street. I don't know what to do. Yes. yes there you go. There we go. I don't. I don't know what to do against this. <laughs> Alex, I need to learn every matchup again. All right. So we got up to snuff. Cheeseburger. Very strong Kali. Mm -hmm. Oh, bullhead in neutral. Let's go. Hold this leg. Doug was saying earlier that this is a matchup that uh, should be in Birdie's favor. Um, and I could see that. Like, I feel like Birdie just wants to keep keep him at a medium kick range. Here, here's, here's the thing. And people may call me crazy for saying this. I think the stubby normals from the Kali is more an illusion than anything. I feel like his normals aren't designed to play footies in the traditional street by the way. But more in the more in the I can press these because I'm guessing what you're going to do and how I'm going to beat him with this normal. Well yeah. They they are stubby. But what I think they have going for them is they stay out for a they're long time. Hella active. They have a lot of active frames. And they're fast. They're yes. very fast. Both of his jabs are three frames, if I'm not mistaken. I don't remember the frame battle on his strongs, but they're fast and they're active. And yeah. those are two things that typically other characters with longer normals don't have. Some normals are only active for one frame. Oh, yeah. If you have a normal that's active for like four, you're on the better end, you know? Oh, what a V trick. No, oh, too no, far. too far, yep. Doug looks like he missed the punish. I think he was anticipating it to hit. I think, he, he I think, I think they both thought that was going to hit, yeah. Doug didn't, Doug didn't have anything loaded. All right, oh, oh, look at that. Man grab the take the win. So, are command grabs also getting the reset to neutral ch nerf or change? I think it's character you? based. It's character based? Okay. Um, Because it doesn't look like what I've heard. I haven't followed every character. Um, I know LPN put together a list that was kind of amalgamating all the information, but I know Alex, from what I've heard, his power bomb is leaving people further away. Why, I don't know, but it, that's, that's what I've read. Laura, on the other hand, her command throw is apparently leaving people closer. So... Um, it, had me, it had me wondering simply because it doesn't look like Macaulay gets as significant an advantage off of his off of successful command grabs as opposed to his regular grabs. Off of his regular grabs, he gets really good pressure, but the command grabs seem a bit questionable. So it had me wondering if his was going to be undergoing anything. Because the throw nerf will definitely affect him. He gets uh, medium off of his both of his throws. Yeah, I've been talking with multiple people about the changes to. Um, the changes to basically the wake up mechanics of this game. Um, they don't want free Oki. They, they don't want pre programmed Oki anymore. They want you to mix people up using what you have. That's also why they're getting rid of Invincible DPs. They want the wake up game to be a guessing game and not this is what you do here, set play. Because um, it was kind of working out where in the beginning people were like, oh, this character has setups, this character, no, everybody has like the guaranteed Oki setups. That became like one of the big things. Like there's whole YouTube videos out there for every character detailing like this is what you do in knockdown situations. If I'm not mistaken, um, if, I'm, if I'm not mistaken, uh, the majority of the cast that isn't top tier per se had those setups, but they were very dependent on whether or not the opponent quick throws yep. or didn't quick rise. Whereas uh, characters like um, Nikali, Kami, even uh, Chun Li to an extent would have those setups regardless of if they quick of they if they quick tech or back tech. So they were they essentially covered both options. I think that's what they're aiming to get rid of here. Ooh. Pixel comeback. Nikali's the kind of character where you give him the finger, he'll take your whole arm. That's uh, that's how I lost a couple rounds up the snuff. I was handling it, dealing with it, and I would just, you know, he. One small I'd make error. that one mistake, yeah. That was it. Nikali with the snowball effect. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's see if Doug can bring it back. 
chances are I'd have to play dog if he lost this. I think. For sure. Hmm. Oh. He, I, uh, if there's one thing about up to snuff, I, he loves to go for the pound. And I, I mean, I get it. You should, as Nikali, you should be ground pounding anytime you, you, you get quickly. the chance. Yeah. Earlier, you can I mean, I've seen matches where Nikali has that B trigger, that B trigger he hasn't ready even to go. Half his life. And yeah, he's at like 75% health, which is just crazy dangerous. Like, ooh, that's a chance. Oh, Nikali back tech so it looked like um, Doug was anticipating a quick rise and wasn't using the appropriate. I wonder how people would feel when they finally realize that Nikali is just a reworked Blanca. You think so? Oh, definitely. He's he's a reworked Blanca. That anti-air was ridiculous. <laughs> he was entirely behind oh. him on the other side, and he landed behind him. Oh, I've seen what was that headbutt? Oh, man. that seen, was the crouching. I've medium. seen that. I've seen that land I've with never, the opponents landing from their jump. That's the that's the latest <laughs> I've ever seen. That I was like, that's yes, I, it, dumb. But it can it goes that far. So I've seen it where the uh, opposing player has landed on the other side. Do you, Bertie? Do you cross up the jump? Birdie is just a rework to say that. Oh. That was a very good anti air. If there's one thing Doug tends to be consistent at, it's anti air. Mm -hmm. Birdie's definitely a character that uh, has that base covered. Excels in that, yeah. Ooh, was that a dust frame from Doug? If so, that was sick. Okay. Oh, he's fishing for super. Ooh. Oh! That was so strange. That was. They had they had to wait for Birdie's uh, involved <laughs> frames to wear off. Very good awareness on uh, up to snuff side. Mm -hmm. And you know what? It's very. I say all the time. Doug doesn't do that a lot. The dolphin no, dive. He doesn't. He yeah. saves it. He puts it in his pocket. And uh, he typically saves it for the end game when people yes. expect it. Of course, most people don't have full super. That's one thing with Nikali. He doesn't have a reason to use a lot of EX. No, he doesn't. So a lot like Karen. He's going to have a super stop you'll see him, the match. You'll typically only see him use it in, I want to say, three instances. You'll typically see him use it for uh, EX command grab, bounce reset, or yep. DP damage. You'll see it for extra damage to finish with um, EX disc guidance if he doesn't have super, which he typically does. Or you'll see him use it. Super. Oh, like Doug tried to sweep there. Oh. Trigger cancel. Let's see if Doug can get anything going. Anti -air. Wow, so late. Oh, wow. That could have been death for Doug. Oh, man. Almost point blank ground pound. Oh, that's it. Doug staying alive. Doug looking like a anime character. <laughs> Doug, 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 looks like, Doug looks like the bully from every high school anime. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, he's like, like he's smoking a cigarette. He's got his two cronies with him. All he needs is, um, all he needs is, um, what is it? That, um, they always have those, um, let me just, let me just focus. All right, yeah, okay. yeah. yeah. <laughs> Anime was a mistake. <laughs> so good luck, uh, little uh, attack string there. Steve playing shockingly past this. Oh, there's the heat trigger. Yep. It's not yeah, gonna, he's still got a ways to go. He's only got one bar. Good B reversal, I like that. You don't need B trigger to win this. You just need one more hit. I would like to see a can right now. Oh, too late for that now. Good oh, jump in. Oh. Now, Good jump in. V reversals are going to knock people further away too, aren't they? Isn't yes. that like the universal? Um, About uh, half the cast have V reversals that do that anyway. I think it's more so for uh, characters that could actually get Oki off their V reversals, like um, Karen, Nikali. Because um, if I'm not mistaken, those characters were able to, they, they, they're pushed back on their V reversals and they knock the opponent down. That That's going to hurt Karen a lot. But we don't know if these are final yet. So no, we, we don't even know if any of these are true. Yeah. I feel like a lot of these were like placebo effect changes. Like people were like, oh, it seems faster. It seems slower. I, I mean, mean, I'm confident a good portion of the changes will be the ones that we get simply because the patches are a week away now. Yeah. Ooh, what a... What? 
At least we think the patch is a week away. Oh, crap. I hit the bomb. Oh, come on, that's it. Come on, Rick A. Come on, Rick A. Final round. All right, Doug fight for his, fight for his life here. For his winner's, his winner's life. Final life. Uh oh. I believe he attempted a punish there, but missed it. Oh wow, that banana, that banana did save right. him, but it was a free V skill for Steve. Unless Steve was intending to go for V skill. Then it's just free V meter. Oh wow. Good, wow. good awareness to punish. They are trying to reach each other so much. Yes, yes they are. Oh, good air to air. Nice. Doug takes the second. Doug evens it back up. Doug being much less, uh, I don't want to say risky. He's being a lot more articulate with his um, defensive play now, mm -hmm. which I like. Well, because, like, I mean, like I said, I think they're both trying to read each other. And I think Doug, by going like he's trying to read me, by being patient, he's just using those reads against him. Um, it could also be like that's kind of the way you gotta play in the alley. You got like you like you said, um, you gotta stick those limbs out. Yeah. Things are flying across the room. Someone protect me. Can't protect me. Patience on Doug. He's accrued quite a bit of great life though. He's got to avoid getting hit. Ooh. Good. Um, I believe that was forward here. Wow. Doug actually using the slide and neutral and requiring quite a bit of he had, he has He had 75% plus of his life and he, he had V trigger. trigger. Yep. Nice punish. Oh. Wow. Grabbed him out of that. Never seen that before. Well, he's probably not airborne to the very end. Oh, what a jump in. A grab's probably better than what he would have gotten had he landed, because he wouldn't have hit that. Ooh. Oh, the walk back. The walk back. I like what Doug was thinking there, but surprisingly, Steve decided to uh, stay patient. Chill. And now he has full meter going into this round. He probably won't use it, but it is an option. Two thirds, three trigger ready. Akali will be activating very soon. Doug does have a bit of a life lead here, though. Oh, that's the whole thing. And now he's up against V trigger and Akali. Oh, so fast. Mix up. Those dashes. <laughs> No, no, anti here. Uh, anti here, jab. Another. And Akali. Man, that's probably uh, not. It's, it's gonna be fun. I, I think that's game. Be there wasn't a lot of hits before that. Right, right, that's good. Yeah, there was only two hits before Ooh. that super. Not a lot of damage scaling. Like, like I suspected, he just does not use any of his meter. He loves that super. I mean, it's, I don't blame you him, can though. close a round out yeah. like with 40% plus and, life. And that damage boost and V-trigger to your super. Yeah. It's it's a lot. I, it reminds me a lot of like when the game first dropped with Karen. Mm -hmm. You saw every round that Karen won ended with super because she had no reason to use the meter. Yeah. Very true, very true. All right, 